No, I, I was not aware of that. To be honest, I didn't know, but thanks God I met you, and so now I know it. No, I didn't know. I knew it was around this time, but I didn't know the specific day. I have several friends who had AIDS and who continue to have suffer from AIDS, so I feel great compassion for them and I wish that there was um, more help for them. Nothing special, I mean they're human beings and right now they live actually very good, they have good medication, so you don't really see it on them when they're sick, so uh, I think it's just normal people. And they're people just like me, just like you, um, I sympathize with what they're going through. Um, I hope there is a cure one day. I know right now there isn't, I believe. Um, so there are people just like me trying to find help. I'm willing to help them. I don't avoid the meeting with them, the conversations or something. To be honest, I haven't met people uh, with this disease, but I know for sure that I will, I, I will not avoid them. I'm from the U.S., and um, I don't think I've ever met somebody that's open about their condition. If they have sex with somebody, they should be informed about that. So if, let's say, they don't tell their partner, then that's a crime technically, so there's policies like that, but as far as receiving treatment, I don't know what the government's doing. Unfortunately, in Russia, it's the country I'm from, it's not so like a common thing to think about it, you know, because this disease is uh, one of the things which uh, Russians don't want to speak about and don't want to think about, to be honest. Of course, they have some like, uh, and government also has some policies uh, among the people, also there are some um, opinions. But to be honest, it doesn't broadcast from t by TV shows and uh, we don't have a lot of information about this disease. Well, I think that the more open we are about sexuality, the more we have a chance to educate young people so that they can be more responsible uh, when they do engage in sexual relationships. And, and we certainly don't want more people to be getting uh, sick with AIDS and other sexually transmitted diseases. So I believe that education is the main way we can achieve that. I think it is sexual education because uh, we need to teach our young girls and boys actually to use condoms because if you don't use a condom then you're not protecting yourself for, uh, from diseases, not only AIDS. That I believe it has to be a part of sex ed sexual education. Um, nowadays a lot of people are not aware of different diseases and infections and they are, you know, being promiscuous and also just not being safe. So I feel like it has to be implemented in sexual education. Uh, it is a little bit, but it should be a lot more, you know, so people can just overall be informed and treat people like they're people and not like they're like they're sickly or anything like that. Actually, it's a lot of 